Today is, um, as I said, we was going to be praying for our country um, of Jamaica. I am tired of the lasciviousness and the things that are going there, going on there. So um, we can't get to come home and have fun and go to the beach like we used to. It used to be such a fun place to visit. Everybody was happy. Everybody was um, joyous and having fun. And now you can't come down there at all. No, you, you, you are afraid. You are afraid to come to our little island that we used to have so much fun, go to the beach and, and, and buy fishes and people were cooking on the beach and you get nice crispy fish and buy me and all that. No, you, you, uh, those people may be suffering because, um, they can't get any, 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 any body to come and buy their product uh, because people are scared because everywhere you go, there is a gunman behind you. There is somebody going, watching and following you and killing you and, and stealing and doing all that. You used to can leave your purse on the beach in your shoes. You put your keys, your shoes, and your clothes, and you just jump off in the water. You come out, nobody bother it. Nobody trouble you. No, you can't do anything like that. But Father, in the name of Jesus, I am here today to tear down Satan kingdom. We are tired of all the lasciviousness. All the killing, all the things that is going on in our little highland. Father, people want to come home and they can't come home because they are scared of the highland that you gave us. We don't want to be in other people's country. We come there to make a living and some people want to go home and relax so they can die and bury with their parents and their foreparents. But Father, Satan is taking over. But we know that you are the true and living God. We know that you said whatever we ask in your son Jesus name, you will grant it unto us. You said there is nothing too hard for you to do. Father, in the name of Jesus, now you're going to cramp and paralyze all the hands that are behind these things. That are pushing these things. If somebody is higher power. That is pushing these young people to do these things. Father, you see that young lady that was crying. That she don't know if she's going to make it. Right now in the name of Jesus. Dispatch your mighty angels God to surround her. No weapon that form against her God will prosper. And every tongue that rise up against her God will come to naught. In the name of Jesus, dispatch your mighty angels now. One to the east, the west, the north, and the south. In the name of Jesus, to encamp around her. Father, in the name of Jesus, she said we don't know New City anymore. But let her know that there are strong women and men that in the city that are praying, that are calling on your name for little Jamaica. Father, in the name of Jesus, give us her victory. Give her the victory, Lord. Let you know that criminal have no power over you and your people. In the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, God, just move on the four carnal point of Jamaica. And bring all those criminal to subjection, God. Under your power. Let them know that there is a God. Let them know that there is a higher power that is responsible for us. And they can tear the highland apart. God move upon the hearts of the Christians. God move upon the hearts of the people. Who said that they are pastors. Evangelists. And missionary. Raise up some new one God. If the ones that you put there. By man are not doing the things that they supposed to do. Now raise up. Heal up Sata. God raise up. Some man and woman. In your name, you raise them up, God. Don't let man give them any title. Because those titles are weak and they can't do anything. 
But when you raise them up, God, they're going to raise up with the power and the authority of Jesus Christ. Like how people used to walk from Montego Bay to Kingston to say, thus saith the Lord. And slay people on Red Hills Road, God. People used to lay down for weeks, slain in the spirit. Father, do it again. Raise up some people. God, stretch forth your hands. Not to destroy God. Not to destroy, but to comfort, but to heal, forgiven. Father, right now, your children are crying out, don't have any hope, don't have anyone. But even though they know that you are the higher authority and we should come boldly to you and come to Nisiri and pray that you will deliver. Father, you will deliver. Even if you have to tear it down like Saddam and Gomorrah. But then you'll build it up. You will let the people who you want to leave. You will let them leave. And even if you have to split the country in two. Like you did to Port Royal God. You will do it. You will do it God. To save your people. You said for the elect sake. You will shorten the days. Father even if you have to shorten the days. But I know that you will do it right now, God. You are the higher authority. You are the maker and heaven and earth. People don't believe you, so they're doing all these things, the lascivious things, Lord, that they are doing. They are doing, carrying on, living homosexual life, doing all these wicked things in your face, and the aroma that is going up to you. Leave a stench in the ear. Father right now in the name of Jesus. While I pray. I know that. Nothing too hard for you. I know you will clean out the city. Even if you have to let policemen go in there. To clean it out. Some people have to go to make some live. Father. Let your people that are spreading the word, let them stand up boldly. Let them not be afraid. Father, let them not be afraid that somebody is coming to kill them. Let them spread your word abroad boldly and protect them, God. Protect them. Let the man with the gun, let the gun shoot himself. In the name of Jesus, Father, Anoint the streets of Jamaica. Anoint the four corner of Jamaica. Anoint every doorpost. Father, we know we don't have to put the blood on the door anymore. We don't, we don't have to kill the lamb anymore. Because you have taken the place of the lamb. But God, in the name of Jesus, put your blood and cover Jamaica. Because it seemed like too much is going on. Father, we want our highland back. Father, we want to take it back. The song said, take me back. Take me back there, Lord, to the place where I first received you. Take us back to our Jamaica that we know we could walk day and night without anybody bother you. Father, take back. Take it back. And if the politicians are doing it, move them, God, and bring somebody in. Bring somebody in with a clean hands and a pure in heart who is going to lead the country victoriously. Father, we come. Father, we come. We believe you because we know that you are God. Whatever you said you will do, we believe you. We come just as you make the leaf and the tree shake and we don't know where it comes from. We come to you. And we don't know where you're going to land. But right now, land somewhere in Jamaica. And let somebody cry out. Drop the gun. Drop the machete. Drop the knife. And cry out. And run to the first church that they see. And say that I sin. I sin. I want to serve the God. Serve God. Let a revival break out in the island. Father, in the name of Jesus. Let a revival break out. All the criminals dropping their guns and their knives and turn to you, God, because you are the true and living God. 
I pray today, God, that you will have mercy, that you will touch, you'll open doors, you'll close doors that need to be closed and need to be open. Father, I thank you, I give you thanks, and I praise your name in Jesus' name. Amen.